Today we're going to talk about mortgage insurance. Hi, this is Melody Wilson with the Real Life team at Remax Elite. I'm here today with Ron Lefebvre with Peer Mortgage, and we're talking about mortgage insurance. There's a lot of questions people have in regards to what is mortgage insurance, and I think the biggest thing to know is there's different types of mortgage insurance, and I'll let Ron tell you a little bit more. Yeah, so the first type of insurance that often uh, people hear about is the CMHC insurance, which um, CMHC doesn't necessarily mean they're not the only insurer out there. There's also Genworth and Canada Guarantee, but um, that's basically insurance that you must take out if you're putting less than 20% down. It's not optional, um, and it's really protection for the bank in the event of a default. If the bank, for whatever reason, had to foreclose on the home, um, the actual mortgage would get paid out um, in full, and the bank would have that protection. So. It's something that um, it's a set fee. It's not a negotiable amount. All three mortgage insurers charge the same amount. It does get added into your mortgage and it's a one-time fee that gets added. Um, there are some benefits to having that mortgage insurance. Like right now, oftentimes you'll see lower interest rates if you have your mortgage insured, which is a little bit different than what uh, we've seen in the past, but it is a big benefit. It used to be everybody really strived to get that 20% down to not have to pay the insurance where um, now the benefit of having that insurance is um, you also get access to lower interest rates, which can offset that cost a little bit. But um, the other types of insurance that are out there that a lot of people tend to um, talk about or ask about that um, when they're buying a home is uh, there's mortgage life insurance, which that's kind of separate. It, it doesn't, um, it's not something that's mandatory. It's something that is optional and uh, that would just kick in in the event of death or if you became disabled, your payments would get um, made for you or uh, there's critical illness. So that's a little bit different than, than mortgage insurance per se. And that can be covered by your life insurance policy. Correct. It doesn't yeah. have to be through the bank. Correct. Yeah, okay. you can have independent life insurance. It doesn't have to be um, covered by the bank. And then uh, the last form of insurance would be um, home insurance. And that's like fire insurance, content insurance, that sort of thing, which is really protection for the home. Um, and again, that one is mandatory. You have to have, um, at the very least, uh, fire insurance. So. Great. Well, that's pretty straightforward. Hopefully that helped clarify what mortgage insurance is, especially if you're buying a house or thinking of buying a home. Those are some costs that you want to consider. So if you have any more questions, feel free to comment down below and we'll be happy to answer. Please share this video and like it. And thanks so much for tuning in. We'll talk to you guys next time.